He is throwing this coat all over town, man. Claire, this pimp don't lie. How many rap stars you know that went to Berkeley High? I'm always with a cup of bourbon. I'm in here choosing, you up here searching. You, you, welcome to the show, everybody. It's me, Ben, and welcome back to a brand new video. Today, y'all, we've got ourselves another Patreon sponsored request, this time around from Cass. Cass, thank you so much for your continued support of the channel, my friend. I appreciate you very, very much. Today, ladies and gents, Cass has told me to sit down and react to a little more G Dragon. Today, we're reacting to Crooked, which is actually very appropriate because at the end of our last G Dragon related reaction, a ton of y'all were saying, Ben, you gotta get to Crooked. You gotta get to Crooked. Crooked. Crooked? Crooked. Crooked. Uh, I'm gonna sip on this caffeine and hope that I wake up before the end of this reaction. See, Mountain Dew, Amp, Game Fuel, this is a, a free sponsorship opportunity. I already drink your product anyway. Hit me up, bro. I want a sponsorship so bad. Seriously, if you have like a a cool drink or like gum or like candy or something and you are interested in I'm promoting other things while being promoted by a patron sponsored video. Is that like conflict of interest? Am I gonna get sued for that? Cass, are you gonna sue me for this? I'm sorry. If you decide to, I probably deserve it. Anyway, let's get to it, y'all. Crooked, G-Dragon, very excited to hop into this one, man. Let's get straight to it. Three, two, one, click, play. If I can move my mouse. What's popping, my friend? I dig the beanie look, for real. Ooh, a little edge to start it too. I love that outfit, bro. And Cass did inform me that the music video is supposed to um, sort of show us the different ways that people can cope or lack thereof when it comes to leaving a relationship. And I can see that already. Mm. Bro, that's my girl. What do you mean? <laughs> He's being a little toxic about it, but that's okay. Sometimes you're that hurt, you know? Damn. He just bit me, bro. Jake the Beat Man, his voice is very expressive as well. So it's perfect for the nature of the song. Man, he's really going through it with the... You're either really hurt or really bored when you're doing something like that. Man, he is... He's going at everybody, bro. Oh, I didn't notice the face on the back. That's actually super sick. He is throwing this coat all over town, man. All over town. Ooh. As much hairspray as we can muster, as we can use. Ugh. That shot was really interesting. Ooh, okay. On it, I gotta talk and I gotta stop and talk about that. That adds so much to the music video, having him sort of pretend that he's sort of holding the camera and then that sort of purple and blue lighting behind him was so pretty. Right here, right there, bro. Wow! I don't know, that just impacted me a lot. That poor guy's food. <laughs> no. Damn, really? In public? For real? He is so done. Who can blame him? For real. Yo, for a second, the way that the lighting was happening because of the car behind it, I think. It looked like it was like raining. But it's not, it was just the light from the car was shining off of something and there was this sort of like glint or whatever. I don't know what it's called, but. Ooh. 
it's the perfect kind of breakup anthem, to be honest, because if there was one way I would describe the song and the way the music video makes me feel, it's numb. He's doing all of these things and feeling all of these different emotions because he's so numb, right? Ugh. It's a bop too, man. Man, seeing him cry is different though. That feels different. Because for the entirety of the video, he's just sort of messing around or kicking food, trying to start a fight with somebody. And then seeing him in that bathroom stall, like kind of crying, that like, <laughs> that kind of hit me. Um, but that's the end of the video. Caps, thank you so much for sponsoring today's video, my friend. I appreciate you very, very much. Overall review from me, uh, a very positive one. Like I said, I thankfully uh, am not in a position where I can really relate to this, but I've obviously had things in my own life where um, I've you know, left the situation feeling very similar to this, right? Maybe not necessarily in the form of a relationship, but in regard to school, in regard to a job situation. Oh yeah, I feel that. Um, and you get to a point sometimes where the best thing you can do is or the best thing it feels like you could do is just go completely berserk. And you, you can't do that, obviously, in daily life because you don't want to be impacting others negatively as well. But um, I think G-Dragon did a really good job in this video of promoting that feeling, right? So he's doing it in the music video so people like us um, when we feel this way, we can come to the music video and rather than feeling like we need to go do the same things that he's doing, we can just watch him do it in the video and find that sort of, what's the word? That like personal satisfaction from seeing him kick over the food and start fights with people and everything. Um, and that's enough for us because we're seeing, you know, one of our favorite artists do it. Um, but yeah, that's it for me. I thoroughly enjoyed this one. But like I said, it, seeing him in the, seeing him in the bathroom stuff definitely was interesting, and it's also potentially appropriate that they left that shot towards the end of the video. It's as if almost like you know how like with like really little kids, um, they'll tire themselves out sometimes, and then they'll just sort of cry at the end. <laughs> I'm thinking back to when both of my little sisters were a lot smaller. I was barely young enough to remember this, but I remember they would do that to themselves all the time, right? They would get pretty upset over something like, you know, you know, not, not, nothing that was like a large deal. And then they would just sort of cry themselves, you know, until they would like fall asleep or something or just be over it and then they would be happy again. Um, and that's kind of what this felt like because G-Dragon is like running around town, throwing the coat everywhere, you know what I mean? And it's like at the end, he just needed to get a good cry out. So hopefully he feels better now. I mean, that comeback is on the way, so. Anyway, that's it for me. I've been talking too long. Thank y'all so much for watching. Caps, thank you so much for sponsoring today's video, my friend. I appreciate you very, very much. Y'all get in the comments and let me know what G-Dragon thing should we get to next? Because I know there's plenty um, to get to, whether it's a music video or whatever else. Thank y'all for watching. That's it for me. Have a great rest of your day. Till next time. Love y'all very much, and peace. Bye.